What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Scott Joy here. I got, I'm always doing something with my hands. Don't know why, but man, today we're gonna be talking about Pro Tools first. I mean, I never used this, never had to use it, but I know some people probably used it, you know, and they don't know what to do or how to get like a decent sound or what you can do with it. And I'm gonna go over it with you right now, so it's free. So you're not gonna have functions like full access to the functions like you would in Pro Tools 12. You don't have access to all your key your keyboard shortcuts. You don't have access to all of those. But we can still do most of them. So now we're gonna make us a record track, right? And so we're gonna make a template. So it's gonna be like a key guard template. No auto tune. Because you, you can't use your plugins. That's the thing about this one right here. You can't use your plugins. These the only plugins that you have. Like this is this is nuts, man. Like I, all my templates have auto tune, but you got two EQs, you got like three compressor, well, three dynamics, you got two reverbs, you know. Got my delay, okay. I can do something with this, you know. Hmm. Like I can do something with this. Let's make a template real quick, like a key glock, like a simple trap template in Pro Tools first, you know. Something real easy, man, that you can open in Pro Tools, the regular Pro Tools. But if you got Pro Tools first. Or if you don't have it and you want to get Pro Tools, I'm going to show you you can do something though. This is the free version too. Excuse me. I know this. This is the free version. So, can I put a Master Fader in? Can I put one? Yo. Master Fader. Stereo. Yo. Let's see. Master Fader Stereo. Let me see what all the options is. Because I got track presets. What it is. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 Alright, so you got presets on on the track, but you no, know, we ain't gonna get in all that. We're gonna make our own. Let's see. Alright. Stereo. I gotta make like two of those. Maybe three. Maybe three of them. So no auto tune, so starting off, we just gonna do one of these EQs right here. So I gotta make the switch over so I can turn this off. Alright. Alright, so I got that turned off. So now it's just me and Pro Tools first. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna like cut out some of my low end because um that's what we're doing. We rapping, right? No auto tune. Alright, so boom, cutting out some of that low, cutting out some of that cutting out some of that low end. We don't need that to get through. Alright. So now I can just put another EQ in and just choose like a random preset. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, that's cool. We could use that preset for right now. And then we got to put a dynamic on it. So with that being said, we're going to put a compressor. And the compressor going to give us a good signal. All we're going to do is just boost it a little bit so we can hear ourselves a little bit better. Excuse me. And then the reverb. I got my D-verb right. So... If we're making a little trap music, it ain't gonna be like super crazy. Come here, bus seven, eight, boom. They're gonna sense. That's how you gotta do your sins right here. I'm tripping. I know what I was doing all along. See, I ain't got no tune. I gotta choose the input for the delay. And we're gonna do a nine ten, right? And we're just gonna go up, put it right here, bus right here on nine ten. I ain't pre follow my pen. Alright, so we got that. And we put our delay plugin on, and we're gonna use the mod delay. Yeah, I right, link those. Let me see. Let me duplicate this. Can I duplicate it? Oh, that works. Right, so let me get like, let me get like four of them. Can I get like four of them? I need four, not forty-four. I need four, four of those right there. Trade it, man. So that's gonna be that right there. Can I go to preferences? No. I can't change my colors, right? So now let's see what we got here and we're gonna record, see if it sounds good, you know, using Pro Tools first plugin. Yeah, yeah. Okay.
it's I mean I'm recording this at twelve o'clock. But you know so we just gonna drag this down. So you know for a fact that I was just recording with no auto tune with stop plugins in Pro Tools first. So I don't need no auto tune. But that's Pro Tools first. It's not hard to use. You just, it's like Pro Tools, but you're not going to have access to everything. That's the only issue. But what you can do, you can't use Waze plugins, UAD plugins, none of that, right? You can't use none of that. But what you can do, you can buy Avid plugins that they have in their store and you'll be able to use those plugins here. Same for like the Avid instruments or whatever like that. If you make beats in here or whatever, whatever it is that you do to use like extra plugins, you gotta buy them through Avid. So if you got cracked plugins and you're trying to use Pro Tools first, it's not gonna work. You got Auto Tune and you're trying to use it, it's not gonna work. But I'm just showing you what you can do with this. But make sure you like, comment, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you in another video. Right. So let me get my thumbnail pick. Ah.